did say that on this trip, I needed to see wild donkeys. I just want to feed them carrots. Still need to F off. <laughs> Pretty sure of it. I don't speak donkey, but if I did. <laughs> Hi, we're Brian and Marisha, and together with our dog Klaus, we're sharing random adventures in our 4x4 Sprinter, Chewy. In this series, we're testing our van's capabilities and attempting to off-road Black Rock Desert, the back roads of Death Valley, and the Mojave Road. We'll be meeting up with some friends along the way, so come along, adventure's calling. Good morning, friends. Klausi and I are out. We're out for our morning walk. It's, it's really early. <laughs> it's probably, I think it's like six. <laughs> so, look at this. Look how cold it is this morning. Our door froze shut. I think it was 68 degrees yesterday. We're uh, freshly crossed over into Nevada and are at a really cool hot spring spot called the Bog Hot Springs, which our friend Double O, thank you Double O, told us about. And we got here kind of later in the afternoon last night and then just camped here. I'll show you a little bit of how yesterday went. We just got done with the donkeys. <gasps> wow, donkeys! Yeah. We're excited, Double O, for your bog hot springs. Uh oh. I hope he didn't uh, rip his Jesus shirt. Brian's mom hates that shirt. We checked the spots further up, but it was nuclear hot. So we're gonna see if we can find something this way. But ooh, look at that view! Yeah, if we can get something between these guys and the next ones down, that's uh, that's a decent amount of space in between. Warm. Is it too warm? No. Sure, go feel it. It's pretty, it's pretty warm. I don't know if I'd call it hot, but mm -hmm. it might be, it might be pretty comfy. Okay. Should we contrast black? Oh, yes. So what's really cool about the Bog Hot Springs, well, first of all, is where we are. It is quite desolate. But if you can see from here, all the steam. So the far right is where the hot spring starts and it's like way too hot to get into. But then that's like a small, almost like canal type river that runs all the way down there. And the entire stream is hot spring. Would love hot springs. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> 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 Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy.
<laughs> like, I don't know, that's not worth it. So today we are gonna leave here probably at some point this morning and then we're about two to three hours away from Black Rock Desert, which is where they do Burning Man. It's pretty sweet because Brian and I, nor Klaus, uh, none of us have been there. So we're pretty excited to go check that out. And there's some ghost towns and all sorts of really cool stuff. So we'll catch you on the road. Getting close. So we came through, I don't know if you can see this. Now we are going to intersect into Black Rock Desert and kind of made this fun little offline map. And these are all these cool little highlights that we get to see, including a spot where somebody got murdered. There's a couple. Dun, dun, dun. A couple murders right now. Klausie, what do you think, buddy? Uh oh, he doesn't like that. He doesn't like rocks hitting. Whoa. Tell us what you're doing, Brian. Huh? You're using your new Christmas present? Thanks, Mom and Dad. <laughs> doing a little air down. Seeing we're gonna be on some washboard road for, so uh, looks like about 71 miles. We officially started Black Rock Desert. When we see anything like this, we have to stop and go see it. This is for Steve and Colleen's camper, Sharky. Shout out. Shout out to Sharky. Oh God, it's hilarious. I love that people take the time to do this stuff. <laughs> That'll be the best. <laughs> Took a pit stop at Massacre Ranch. What is it? Great shape. It's a building that they allow people to camp in. What? Yeah. So they have like everything set up in here. Holy Tables. Crap. Supplies that people leave behind. We got some white cheddar popcorn. You love that stuff. Right? I, do. I do. Got some Justin's. Cashew butter. Simply good chocolate caramel. This is awesome. Whoa. Uh -huh. Prison beds. Yeah, can lighting. It almost looks like it has electricity. It does. It has a, a electrical box on the outside. What do you think, Klaus? Cool. Kind of creepy, man. It's a little creepy. Ooh. Something touched me. <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Something touched my head. I'm out of here. I didn't see anything. Well, that's my point. This really cool old oven. I don't know if it's super old, but I'm going to assume it is. Whoa. <laughs> Gross. Uh, perfect. Come straight towards me. <laughs> we got we got a little turned around and had to do a eight point turn to turn around our little map our map let us astray so we're going to see oh yeah have him walk with me come on buddy anyway See if we can 
get uh, get back on the right road. This is the road we were driving down, which eventually turned into nothing. Come on, buddy. All right, fill you in later. One of the highlights of Black Rock Desert overlanding is driving through High Rock Canyon. Woohoo, right? Wrong. I'm walking. Well, we're not having a great day. We've been um, on this, like kind of this discovery route in Black Desert all day. And we've hit a few really tough, just muddy or snow. We're starting to run into snow now, uh, who knew? And it's just, it's just getting all of this kind of clay just the worst kind of mud. So, we're very tired. I wish I would have filmed some of this. Uh, yeah, this has just been a trying day, but man, it's so disappointing. Um, there's nothing worse than having to go through some really hard spots and know you have to do it again. So, poor Brian. I'm hungry. I'm hungry too. I want, booze. I want booze too. I want some other things as well, but those shall be unnamed. <laughs> and we get to do this fun, fun thing again. This won't be bad. No, I'm gonna get it from the other side though. Well, at least we get to watch Brian do this hard part again. Ooh, that looks really slippery going down. Oh shit. Oh my God. Unbelievable. Nice work. That looks really sketchy for a second. You got mud in the car. Uh, wouldn't be the last time or the first time. It's more sketchy than the way down actually. Yeah, I thought you were headed right for that rock pile. Does that look all right? You look great. Well, with that said, we're going to wrap up today <laughs> uh, and we're going to camp in Ireland. Check it out. Camping in Ireland. Welcome to day three, which is really similar to day two, except in reverse. <laughs> We're backtracking out Black Rock Desert. Um, let's assess this. I think we came from that way. Yeah, I think those are our Not, tracks right there. Yeah, so let's go, uh, we'll go check. So yeah, we don't have our map anymore because we got off trail on purpose because we had to. Didn't want to backtrack and uh, haha -ha now. And then the map we were using, the Google map that we had saved somehow in the night disappeared. So any any road maps we had were, were super screwed. <laughs> but um, I'm a tracker. tracker. We did, tracking our tracks. Brian watched a lot of Longmire and he's a tracker now. Actually, yes, because remember the we were like, oh, yes. we could camp there. Could totally. Okay. Probably should have. We actually definitely Well, I don't should. know. <laughs> it wouldn't have mattered. Then we would just be going turning that, around later morning. on this morning. So <laughs> That's true. That's probably good that we didn't. <clears throat> That's true. Everything happens for a reason. Uh, so now, seeing we're, we're the only people out here, we'll be able to follow our tracks uh, from yesterday. All right. More to come. We found an offshoot. A reroute option two that goes around the the mud bog a big mud pit we went through yesterday which was no good because we bottomed out a couple times so we're gonna see how this one is how's it look all right yeah. oh 
Yeah, I don't even know if I can cross it. If I try and, well, it's pretty. Yeah, this is no problem, except I don't wanna, oh yeah, we're not doing that. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> I can't cross. Rocky and icy. Nice. Rocky that much. Yeah, that's good. Good job. Good job. Well, we missed out on the canyon and had to backtrack out. But we wanted to see something, so we routed out past Fly Geyser for the win. We have not seen pavement in two days. Vultures are circling for us, Lori. Yeah, so they thought we were going to die. Our off road trail. We are coming up on our turn. Keep your eyes peeled for a left hand turn, cows. Got it. We're going to see the fly, fly geyser. What's that all about? I don't know. I just know it's a geyser and it's called Fly Geyser and it's in here. Got it. I know he's pretty excited about this paved road. And it looks like it might be. Right here on the left, like right here, right here, right here. Yes. No trespassing. No trespassing. Fly Ranch Nature Walks. Hold on, hold on. Private property. Circuit Television. No trespassing. We can't go see the geyser. Pretty sure this is private property. Well, that sucks. Black Rock Desert 4, Brian and Marisha Zero. We finally met up with our first travel buddy, Jim, but you'll never hear us call him that. It's double O. He's been here? I think he has, I think he said he has once he came by. It was a young, young governor. Yeah, it was. His bullet flowing in the wind. This I Rock Z. Yeah, it's <laughs> Camaro. Rockford Files Camaro.
typical. Got to go back that way, okay? Because where I'm at is dry. See the color. Yeah, the color piece. for max tracks um, this is super soft her driving along and it literally changed from rock hard <laughs> dirt sand mud whatever this is uh, to this like look look how soft that is and I don't wear ne weigh nearly as much as chewy and we have probably 20, 20, 30, 31 gallons of water on board as well, uh, plus another five in fuel. So, I mean, it's not good. It's not good, no. But it's, you know, I've seen worse. Oh, no. Uh, wow. Yeah, this, it's wet. Little did we know the playa has tributaries that run year-round, making some sections impassable. There really is something to be said about research people. Hmm. The more you know. Alright, I'll pick you up in a bit. Happen. We had a little casualty of the mud. Poor Bailey. Poor Bailey. And Jim. Man, talk about sticky. Living life. Living life. Woo. Me think, B. How'd that go? Living life. <laughs> what's the What's the score right now? Five nothing. <laughs> Five nothing. Five nothing. Five nothing. Okay, Black Rock three. Nope. Nope. Black Rock five. Bride and Marisha. Yep. Still zero. Still zero. Don't mind the dirty windows. We stopped to help a guy on the middle of nowhere who broke down horse trailer. So there's B being a little mechanic. Ready to hit the road again, bud? Ready to hit the road again? Why didn't you eat your breakfast? Yeah, you boycotting? What's going on today? There's our disaster zone back there. Welcome to my nightmare. I don't think you could pay me one million dollars to sleep in here. Oh, we're gonna go check this out for sure. It's freaking sweet. Yeah, it's good stuff. We like it. That's where it's at right here. <laughs> Just 
because now we've been there, so that was what we have to do. And we're gonna hit these hot springs before we go into Death Valley. And I don't know much about them, so I guess we'll, we'll show you when we get there. Welcome to day four. We just pulled up to Alkali Hot Springs. We've been battling a dust storm all day. So we'll see how enjoyable this is. All right, but would you what side? What side? All right. No. Yeah. You can do it. You can do it. Yeah, you can do it. Put big boy pants on. You got this. You got this. No. Yep. No. 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 Not no. Now. Not alone. Not alone. No way. Yeah, no. Okay. no not we'll, we'll see you in five minutes. We're going to try that again. Thank you for bearing witness to the Black Rock ass kicking we received. Next time we enter into Death Valley and explore its amazing back roads and may or may not end up at one of Charlie Manson's favorite hangouts. Make sure you like and subscribe so you don't miss a thing. Adventure is calling.